Welcome to Lost Media News. I am Lava Canyon and I will be covering five pieces of lost media and two pieces of found media. The Corner Bar. The Corner Bar is an ABC sitcom television show airing from 1972 to 1973. The show is about a man named Harry Grant who owns a bar and the employees who have their own stereotypes including a Jewish and homosexual character. In season 2, the show had most of the cast change. The bar owner switches to someone named May. There are 16 episodes in all, none have been archived. Once Upon a Tree Once Upon a Tree was an educational show that aired on a few channels including one called Animal Planet. It is unknown its air times, but it is assumed to be during the late 90s and early 2000s. 24 episodes have been released on VHS, which are assumed to be mail order. Three of the episodes which were found were released on VHS console called Video Buddy and would ask questions during the show. Kirby Silo View Minigames Silo View is a broadcast network from Nintendo for the Super Famicom that let you download games using a modem. Many of these games were exclusive to the service including a set of Kirby minigames. Nine minigames were available to download at in different intervals. Eight of these minigames were actually found recently though, so it is really the one left that is unknown. Sonic 3D Blast Demo Cassette Sonic 3D Blast for the Sega Genesis had many unused assets, though one of the more sought after is an unused special stage song for Knuckles that was later used in Sonic Adventure's Trinkle Park. John Burton, founder of Traveler's Tales, owns the cassette with the demo music but needs to have permission from Sega before being sure that it can be released to the public. So it's mostly just waiting at this point. I don't know whether we'll get the green light on that, but he can absolutely reach out, uh, and I'd be happy to run it up the flagpole. Yeah, all right, thank you. Yeah, you're very welcome. So as Aaron Weber suggested, I reached out to him via Twitter. Only problem is, that was four days ago and I still haven't had a reply. This one is an oldie, but the mystery is still there. It is Tord Larson's full explanation video. Tord Larson was an artist and voice actor in the Flash animated series Ed's World. He left the series in 2008, though had a brief cameo in a 2010 episode. In 2012, Ed Gold, the creator of Ed's World, would pass away from cancer. After this, Tord decided to make an explanation video discussing his strain. Tord explained that he wanted to lead a life independent of his persona of the series because of the harassment and impersonations caused by his fame. He soon deleted his channel, making the video lost. Tord Larson has never been heard of since then. This has been a very good time for found media. Two big pieces of lost media were found. Firstly, the Space World 97 beta realms for Pokemon Gold were dumped and now are playable. Many differences are evident in this version than the final. The second evolution of the Chikorita line is different and the water and fire starters are completely different. In fact, many of the Gen 2 Pokemon designs were radically different than the final build. There are some gameplay differences including a skateboard you could ride. Though the most interesting change, however, is the fact that the map layout is designed around Japan. The second big find was the Maiden Point Richmond Pixar DVD, found by Jarrett35 who uploaded the ISO. The DVD was given to Pixar employees and archives many of the unpublic Pixar work. This includes all or most of the TV commercials made by Pixar, the Christmas party videos from 1986 to 1994, 
and an original version of the short knickknack that was changed before being officially released. All the commercials contain copyrighted content so Pixar wouldn't have been able to release them to the public. Before this, the only way to find these commercials were to have recordings of the channels that originally aired them. The unidentified section of the Lost Media Wiki forums is a place for users to post media that they remember but can't confirm the existence of. Here is the most interesting one from this month. Weird DIY Show Slip Up Sometime between 2010 and 2012, on a Sunday morning in Springfield, Missouri, my dad and sister were getting ready to go to the church when they had the TV on in the room. It was some sort of live DIY type show and the main lady was making some sort of rice neck pillow and she was saying how easy it was and then some other lady said, It's so easy, it pumps it all the way up to DIY to DIE, everybody. Everyone around her looked at her weird and then they continued the show. I've never been able to see it, I can't find it anywhere online. Do any of you guys have any ideas on what this is? If you need more information, I'll give it to you. I tried to get as much information I thought I needed though. This post was made by the forum member Baby Daisy Lover. Since this seems to be a live TV show, the chances of it being archived is very low. Errors are known to happen on live shows like these. A link to the original forum post can be found in the video's description. That is the highlights of this month. If there is a notable event that happened recently that you think should be mentioned next month, make a comment on the latest Lost Media News video, it will help out in multiple ways. And check out the Lost Media Wiki. If you're aching for another Lost Media video, a channel named Kenny Lauderdale made a video about the partially lost series Lensman.